The CDC describes arsenic as an element that occurs naturally in rocks and soil and is used for a variety of purposes within industry and agriculture. Unfortunately, arsenic and many of its compounds are also potent poisons. The International Agency for Research on Cancer recognizes arsenic and inorganic arsenic compounds as Group 1 carcinogens. The U.S. Environmental Protection Agency reports that arsenic has been linked to a number of cancers, including cancer of the bladder, lungs, skin, kidney, nasal passages, liver, and prostate. Some of the non-cancer effects of arsenic exposure listed by EPA are shown on the screen. People can be exposed to arsenic from a number of sources, including from drinking water where it is tasteless and odorless. Arsenic can enter drinking water supplies from natural deposits in the earth or from agricultural and industrial practices. CDC reports that it is widely believed that naturally occurring arsenic dissolves out of certain rock formations when groundwater levels drop significantly. Some industries also release significant amounts of arsenic and arsenic compounds into the environment. Any in the air will eventually be removed by rain, snow, and gradual settling. Once on the ground or in surface water, arsenic can solely enter the groundwater. High arsenic levels in private wells may also come from certain arsenic-containing fertilizers and herbicides that were used in the past or from industrial waste. In the United States, the maximum concentration in drinking water allowed by EPA is 10 parts per billion. However, EPA does not regulate private wells and the agency estimates that more than 13 million households in the U.S. rely on private wells for their drinking water. Private well owners are responsible for the safety of their water and this is why testing for contaminants, such as arsenic, is so important. These are just a few of the many things to know about arsenic in private wells. To learn more about this or other aquatic, environmental, building science, industrial hygiene, health, or safety issues, please visit the website shown on the screen. IAQ-TV, the place to be.